If this is your first time using the stock game in your class, this video will walk you through the basics of placing your first trade. Let's get started. On the student dashboard, you can see your open positions from the My Portfolio widget. If you haven't placed any trades yet, you'll see a few options to choose from to help you get started. You can also research companies by going to the Investing Research menu. Click Trading Ideas to see a list of popular stocks. The Symbol Lookup page will help you get the ticker symbol of any publicly traded company. Search by company name to get their unique ticker symbol and their financial information. View financial statements, analyst ratings, share performance, and more to discover if this is a good buy. When you're ready to place a trade, click stocks from the stock game menu. You can access all the other security types enabled in your class from this menu as well. On the trading page, choose the type of trade you want to make under action. The default is buy, but you can also sell, short, or cover when placing a trade. Next, enter the ticker symbol and choose the right option from the drop-down menu. After you've entered the ticker symbol, you'll have access to company information to help you decide how many shares you want to purchase and at what price. In the quantity field, put in the total number of shares you want to buy. Under order type, choose if you want to purchase shares at the current market price or choose one of the other options. You can learn more about placing other order types as well as other securities by going to the tutorial videos on the stock game menu. When you're done entering all the information, click Preview to review your order. Trade notes might be mandatory in your class. If so, you'll need to explain why you're placing this trade to continue. Next, click Confirm. Congratulations, you've just placed your first trade. If you're ready to place another trade, go ahead and click Place New Order. Under the Stock Game menu, you have access to more detailed information about your portfolio. The Portfolio Summary page will provide a breakdown of your available cash, your current buying power, the market value of your holdings, how many trades you have left in your session, the money you've spent on commission, and how much you've earned in dividends. Other useful pages are your transaction history, order history, and trade notes to see your historical trading data. Your open positions are where you can see your current holdings and review how well each investment is performing. From here, you can see charts of your holdings or view more detailed information by clicking the plus button beside the ticker symbol. In this financial simulation, the real-time data has a 15-minute delay to respect the rules of the stock exchanges. So, after you place a trade, it will take 15 minutes for the pricing information to appear on screen. If your class has other security types enabled, you can view your other holdings by choosing the right type from the drop-down menu. To close your position or to sell your shares, click Trade and the system will take you back to the trading page. If you want to see how your portfolio is performing compared to everyone else in your class, go to My Rankings under the Stock Game menu. You can see rankings based on the weekly, monthly, or the overall performance of your portfolio. There you have it. Now you know how to place a trade, how to view your portfolio, and how to access class rankings. It's time to keep practicing and remember, don't put all your eggs in one basket. Thanks for watching.